wide open the standings. Top three teams, all four and four, but the Rams three and four as they take on the Seahawks this weekend. Kyle, as we said, it, it is a tight race in the NFC West. Who do you see in this matchup trying to get a leg up at least? I know. Don't let the Rams get hot. Don't do it, guys. Do not let the Rams get hot. Don't let Matt Stafford get a hot hand or Sean McVay. I love now. We've been hearing about Puka all morning. We're seeing all this video of him running around again. They didn't trade Cooper Cup. They weren't going to trade Cooper Cup. I don't care what anybody said. I like, actually, the Rams in this game. I know Seattle's tough at home. At least I thought they were. I mean, Buffalo beat him by about 50 last week at home. I actually think the Rams are going to reintroduce themselves to the conversation now. I like uh, L.A. here. Just let me reintroduce myself. My name is... Yeah. Nuke, Puka Nakua. <laughs> no, I was about to go somewhere yeah. else. <laughs> Puka Nakua, Cooper Cup, they're back. Uh, I saved myself. I didn't get canceled. Uh, but that offense is hot right now because they've got their, their dogs back uh, at the wide receiver position. And then the Seattle Seahawks defense, they're giving up 30.4 points per game. That is not acceptable against this offense. No, yeah, I got the Rams, too. And, and my, my, my big thing is against Ryan Grubb, the offensive coordinator for the Seattle Seahawks. Listen, the, the quarterback shotgun run game does not work in the NFL when you don't have a QB that poses a run threat. Right. Ryan Grubb, throw that out. Right. I know this is your first year in the I NFL. Like Sorry, but Two buzzers. Ryan Grubb, Woo. Double stop buzzer. running that. Stop running that. Stop running that. Tell us more, Manti. No. 